everyone, it's Richard and Sophia here. This is the next part of our dad and daughter 3D printer build. We're building up the kit of the Perusa i3 from the kit supplied by Joseph Perusa. So we've been doing quite well, haven't we? And last time we just finished off final bit of wiring, installing the power supply. And what else was there? Oh, putting in the LCD at yeah. the front, which was the display. That was quite nice, wasn't it? You did most of putting all that together and clipping mm -hmm. it in. So that was really good. And, um, oh, fun thing I found out today that um, Joel, the 3D printing nerd, he's another great YouTuber doing 3D printing. He's also has also got one of these kits and he's also building it up with his daughter, Sydney. So would you like to say hello? Hi, Sydney. Excellent. Yeah. Hi, Sydney. I hope you're getting on okay with the 3D printer build. So it'd be really great to see how you get on with that. We're really thoroughly enjoying it. And we're on the last stretch. We've got the heated bed to put on now. We're on that step in the instructions. Uh, after that, we have to put the Rambo board in, which is the electronics that control the 3D printer, and then wire everything up. And then a few little checks and we'll be ready to go. So, should we get on with it? Yep. Let's do it. <laughs> Right, so we're in the middle of putting the heated bed on the platform and the Y carriage is really just not wanting to line up at all. So I'm going to investigate, aren't we, and try and figure out what's going on because I can get two of the corners in and then the others don't line up or I can get the centre ones in and then all four corners don't seem to line up. So I'm worrying that there's something slightly wrong either with the metal Y axis or something else because it's just not quite right. So we will investigate and try and figure out but this is not going together very well mm. at all at the moment on this last little bit. Just not lining up. So we'll figure it out. Got a bit of... Is that Blackberry crumble? Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> You'll have to soak that if it's black. Is it blackberry crumble? Blackberry crumble, right. <laughs> anyway. Okay, you ready? It <laughs> <laughs> just literally in on my t shirt. Okay. Okay, so we totally figured out what was wrong with mounting the heated bed, and it was our mistake. So. Back in the instructions, when you create, when you put the Y-axis assembly on, it's very clear in the instructions and it shows you that there's a little, little white dot on the metal Y carriage at the bottom. Now, I knew about that because we read it, didn't we? And we were trying to make sure we had it exactly right and in the right orientation. But what we did, we had it in the right orientation, but we had it upside down, didn't we? Yeah. So the little white dot was on the underside of the platform. And it's got to be on the top <laughs> side of the platform, <laughs> otherwise it doesn't fit. So you can get the four screws in, but the two middle ones that hold the plastic piece that holds the belt in don't line up. They're half a millimetre, all slid to one, to one side which the engineer in me says that's really frustrating because they could have been symmetrical and lined up so it wouldn't matter which way you put the platform up and down. But, and I can't think of a good reason, Joe, why you designed it that way, hmm? Mm. Don't know, but anyway, so make sure you get your platform the right way around with that little dot facing upwards. So not facing down, <laughs> so it's really important, isn't it? Yeah. As soon as we did that, it went together absolutely perfectly lined up absolutely perfectly so no problems at all so we got a bit frustrated with that one and we have to open the next thing of power bow yeah. so do you want to try which one do you want to try have i'm not sure one? about these ones but no i've not had one yet so oh my god are they what are they like they're good mm, power bow flower power are very good <laughs> very good anyway so we've just put the um 
Rambo electronics box on, haven't we? And we've got all the cables ready to go in there, and we're about to put the Rambo electronics in. And we're going to be pretty close to being done right after that. Mm -hmm. So we're going to do that right now, and we'll show you what it's like when we're completely done. <coughs> yep. <laughs> do you want another one? Yeah, that's okay. quite good actually. Which one did you have? Which um, colour? The first rather scary day at my second resort. There were there was a friendly looking girl with plates plats plats sit, yeah. sitting in front of me. Ooh, that's nice. Yep. It's almost finished. Is it? Yep. What do we have to do next? Um, just put the wires on and connect them together. That's all. That's all. Can we do it now? Like. Of course, yeah, yeah. Well, you carry on with your reading, we'll do it in a minute. I'll do it quick. I'll read 14 pages. Okay, you read 14 pages. No, 15. Okay, go on. that's what I need for Excited? Uh -huh. Okay, so we just finished putting the electronics on and wiring all up. That's plugging in all the connectors. There's no soldering or crimping or anything like that to do. And actually, little fingers were good, weren't they? Mm -hmm. Your little fingers got in the mm. inside the electronics and pushed all the connectors on. Yeah. So we've just double checked everything, and we think we're ready to go. And we haven't turned it on yet. So this is the very first time, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You excited? You a little bit nervous? Yeah. I am as well. I am a little bit as well, but I've got the power here, so we're going to make sure the switch is off, and we've got the switch switched to 240 volts because we're in the UK, and I'm going to plug this one in. Okay, right, let's just wait then. So do you want to flip the switch? Hang on. Three. You're going to put this one here. Three, two, one. Right, ready? Three, two, two one. one. Oh. Yay! Let's come on. Yay! Yay! We have <laughs> English. So you can now select English as unless you want to do it in Italian. No. no? Let's just select English then. Yeah. Right. The printer has not been calibrated yet. Please follow the manual chapter. First steps, calibration flow. Right. So I think actually because it's really late, we should probably leave that until tomorrow because it yeah. is past bedtime now. Um, but we, at least we know it looks like it's all going to work. So we'll do all the calibration and set up tomorrow night and um, maybe get your first print on yeah. your 3D printer. And you'd have to create a name for it. What do you want to call it? Sophia's Awesome Printer or something like that? The Sophia. Okay, the Sophia. Ooh, very good, I like that. Okay, so if you join us tomorrow, we will be calibrating and printing some very first things. Think about what you want to print. Maybe another buddy, because they were quite yeah. cool. We like buddy. Okay, yeah, so let's turn this off, and it's time for bed. Mm -hmm. Okay. Time Good night, everyone. Night. See you next time. Night night.